Assalamu alaikum beautiful people. Today I will discuss the topic quantity of water and cement for mix ratio are different grades of concrete. I hope this video can help you. So if this topic is important so you may like this video and subscribe this channel with press bell icon if I upload any video so you will get notification for new updates. So let's start. Quantity of water and cement for different grades of concrete. So guys in first column you can see grades of concrete and second max ratio mix ratio for different grades. The third one is water cement ratio. The fourth one cement and cages. The last one water and letters. Quantity of water and cement for different grades of concrete just for one cubic meter concrete. Just for one cubic meter concrete I will give you the value for water and letters, cement and kg and different water cement ratio. So guys as you know in many videos I have discussed what is grade of concrete. If you don't know so you should learn. What is grade of concrete? M which stand for mix and 5 is the characteristic strength of concrete after 28 days. So remember if you want to watch the grades, uh, grades of concrete video in detail, so the link is in the description of this video. Go there and watch. Remember guys, for M5 grades of concrete, the mix ratio is 1 ratio 5 ratio 10. Where 1 is cement, 5 is sand, and 10 is aggregate or crush. So same video, okay? Same thing for all. So for M5, 5 grade of concrete the mix ratio is 1 ratio 5 ratio 10 and its water cement ratio should be 0 0.6 right so cement and cages for 1 cubic meter concrete for m 5 grade concrete we required 137.5 kg cement for this cement we required 82 liters of water so how we will get this video remember if you need so this is its example so 0 0.6 is just for 1 kg cement so 0 0.6 multiply 137.5 kg cement then you will you will require a to two liters of water so this is its calculation same you can get 0 0.55 multiply 169 kg of cement then you will get the value you will require 93 liters of water okay so for m 7.5 the ratio is 1 ratio 4 ratio 8 so the water cement ratio for m 7.5 is 0 0.55 then you required 169 cement kg and cement uh, cement and kg and you will require 93 liters of water for m 7.5 concrete for one cubic meter okay for m 10 grade okay which characteristic strength is 10 newton per mm square after 28 days so the ratio is max ratio is 1 ratio 3 ratio 6 1 part cement 3 part sand 6 part aggregate so where the water cement ratio is 0 0.5 for m 10 grade of concrete so you will require 220 kg cement and you will require 110 liters of water okay for m 15 the ratio is 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 okay which water cement ratio is 0 0.5 you will require 314 kg cement water required 157 liters for m20 which ratio is 1 ratio 1.5 ratio 3 water ratio is 0 0.45 you will require 400 kg cement for one cubic meter concrete 
and 180 liters of water remember this is the extra this is a short note for you so m20 grade concrete which ratio is one ratio 1.5 ratio 3 it should be used for beam column and slab minimum use m20 grade concrete for beam column and slab okay the last one is M25, the ratio is 1 ratio, 1 ratio 2 and water cement ratio is 0.4%. You will require 550 kg cement and the water required 220 liters. Okay, so guys, this is the very important and useful notes you can say if you are working on construction site if you are student so you should remember these things which i've discussed the front of you simply grade of concrete is the very important and interesting topic especially in concrete and remember its ratio it can help you on construction site also remember its water cement ratio and for one cubic meter so this is also the value you should remember and these are the layers of water okay so how you will get how much water you required for M25 or M20 grade concrete. So the water cement ratio should be multiplied with total, quant uh, total cement and kg. Then you will get the value of water in liters or in kg because one kg is equal or one liter is equal one kg. Okay, so in one cubic meter volume, we have 1000 liters of water. So this is a short video which can help you and the future especially in civil engineering engineering thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye